Leslie. I am going to be starting a new series. So every Tuesday I'll be coming out with a really short video, usually a minute or less, with answers to questions that I've either received from one of you guys or from a client while I'm out working in the field or even just frequently asked questions that I find are helpful to have answered to. They'll all be real estate related. And if you have any questions, feel free to either text me, DM me, email me. I'm always happy to answer. And then I'll probably use it as a topic for one of these questions each week. Okay, so today we're going to be talking about what you need to have ready when you're looking to move into a new apartment or home for rent. So to rent a new apartment or home, you're going to need to have a copy of two months of bank statements, two months of pay stubs, a copy of an ID, which could be either a passport, driver's license, or state ID. And you're also, gonna need, you're also going to need to have some money saved up, and that's gonna be for your security deposit and first month's rent. And those are both due when you sign your contract, generally. So let's say, for example, you are moving into a new apartment at the beginning of the month, and your security deposit is one and a half months rent. Generally, it's going to be either one and a half months or two months rent. So let's say your rent is $2,000. So you're going to owe $2,000 for your first month. You're going to also owe $3,000 as your security deposit because that's one and a half times your month's rent. So total, when you sign your agreement, you're going to owe $5,000. So you need to make sure you have a decent amount of money saved up when you're looking to move, if like if you have a lease that's coming up and you know you wanna move, that's something to consider. You need to have some money saved up so that you can put that money down for your security deposit. And in a future video, I'll talk about how to do a walkthrough and make sure that you can get as much money of your security deposit back as possible. All right, let me know if you guys have any questions and I hope you have a great day.